313 Gibson Les Paul slash Vermilion. Beautiful. What do you think this neck profile is? It's thinner. Uh, yeah. It's kind of like a 60s neck profile, isn't oh, it? Yeah. <laughs> smoother sounding than that last one. I think it's those Alnico 2s maybe? <laughs> Now that you've heard Guy play it, <clears throat> let's get up close and check it out. We gave this one an 8.8 .8 out of 10 condition. It's just got some light scratches and a few small dings. Alrighty. This part of the top all looks great. Just some light scratches kind of in that little, little area right there. Some light little scratches down there. Yeah, I mean, overall, though, the top looks really good. Fronts are in great shape, no wear. Let's check those out. Just needs a little bit of polish on that truss rod cover, but can I get a polish rag from you? That looks better. All right, let's get this thing flipped over and we'll see the back of it. Headstock reads one, two, five, two, three, zero, five, two, three. Made in USA, 2013. Back of the headstock looks nice and clean. There's no cracks or anything like that. All right, let's check out the back of the guitar. Back looks really good. Just some small dings right there. The back is the reason why I gave it an 8.8 8 out of 10. I mean, the front of the guitar is really clean. So fortunately, anywhere, it's going to be on the back. But you just got some, some small dings on the back there. They're all on the clear coat. All right, on the next. 